I don't mean to be fatalistic. But we had a really rough run with luck. Uh, lo like having all those interceptors crippled and then losing that satellite really early uh, set us up uh, such that the aliens in rapid succession, because they didn't have a satellite, a spare satellite built, because I had rushed instead to get ground stuff and build the base out. Early laboratory. I really wanted to see if that would help. And early laboratory does not really seem to be helping. I feel like the money I spent to build that would have been much better spent on an interceptor for a slightly stronger air game. Uh, or, I mean, it's hard to say. I have laser weapons coming now, and that is only because, you know, only because I had. Oh my god, this is a terrible map. <laughs> this is really, this is a really hard map. Um, it's only because I built that early lab, right? And they're just hitting us really hard right now before Liz weapons come out. This is big sky. Team it's the vanilla deployment. That's this is. This, wait, what's that? Strike one is clear to engage. Is that half cover? It's full cover. That's full cover. I don't want to run you over there in case there's, like, you know, shit over there. So, how about we send... Beardless one step to the left to make sure it's clear. It wasn't. Muton. Three floaters. Okay, in that case, Thirsty, take that position. We're going to do some smoke time, so this is not going to be safe no matter what we do. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh, man. Really? Heck yeah, kill it, Renee. Nice. Are we smoking people out of cover? Is that, like, what's really about to happen right now? Beerless doesn't have low profile yet. Okay. That car is maybe a death sentence because of the muton. Oh, but the muton is also on a car. There's no, no, nowhere to put people that's really going to be safe. The Mutant can run out of cover and be really freaking crazy. We're going to have to smoke this car, which Hibugo can do. Yeah, that might be a flank on the Mutant right there. Is it? Oh, fuck us. Okay, we we need to abort this mission, I think. Because they are going to grenade this car. We already have people stuck out of cover anyway. We're stuck here for this turn. We're going to take some losses this turn, I'm afraid. Can you flashbang? One. Oh, you can, you can get a both. You beautiful infantry. Surface, you put that rocket right in the middle. It almost doesn't matter where it scatters. Right between those two. Surface is going to be out of cover for this. It's scary, but we have to kill a lot of these assholes right now. And if we can kill a lot of them right now, we might get out of this. Open broadcaster software. You were born for this. this. Three thin men. This is the risk we're taking. Another muton down. Kind of lost count here. This one's going to be a problem. They're probably going to try. I mean, no. OBS can maybe take one hit. Maybe. 
61%? What the fuck is the defense in that thing? That sucks. Come on. Any closer than that? No, I saw that little eh. Give me the eh. Over here? No. No. Oh, God, don't do this to be Zach's gun. Oh, we might lose OBS here because I activated those packs. Let me turn down. Uh, that's probably not going to be a kill. Smoke OBS. Okay, anyone else with that? No. Smoke OBS. And everyone, cross your freaking fingers. Alright, I'm hoping that the Muton panics, but they're not likely to. We killed a lot in that turn. Okay, falling back. Oh, full run. He panicked. Okay. Floater also falling back. Full panic. No such luck with that mutant. But it's a miss. Yep. Don't die, OBS. Shit. No, 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 no. Suppression. Fascinating. Okay, OBS is in smoke. You can probably run to get the fuck out of there with that to protect them. Let's see what else we can do. We can actually, we have an advantage, kind of. We can push it. Lock that asshole down. That car can't be counted on. We're getting away from that car now. Yeah, can you see that thin man? You can. Put some hurt on it, please. Nice damage. Sarah Pace is as nice and exciting as it is for you to like fight out of cover. We we're going to put you somewhere else in a second. That one's already suppressed. Put some hurt on it. Nice. Adjusting aim. <laughs> Timothy, you're probably going to move up right there. Oh, I, I want to try to take out this, so you have to blow through that to do anything there. Dash over there, Beardless, so we have better eyes. Can't quite click close enough for a med kit there. Uh, say, hold that thought. I need OBS to go to full dash. Get the fuck out of there. Beardless, seven months! Don't die, OBS! No! Oh. That sucks. That sucks a lot. Pull up, Zimothy. Don't let OBS's sacrifice be in vain. I get to cover, Sarah. No more, no more gallantly firing out of out of fucking cover. It's, don't worry about it. It was 50-50. They're heavily armored and they have a big bonus. It makes me sad. I liked OBS. OBS was a fun character name. Yeah, I see you, jerk. Don't worry. Full-on panic from that other Muton. That's nice. Oh, God, no.
Sending OBS in that deep was a mistake. I should have put them in a little bit, but not quite that deep. All right, grenades. Actually, go ahead, go ahead, go HE, because maybe we can clear the cover and kill both of them. Right, put it right there. Great damage there, perfect. Hold, hold up, Yeti. We got a lot to do here. Yep, kill the thin man. One thin man down, one to go. Stay that rocket for next turn. Yeah, go ahead and hollow target that smug. Nice. Renee, you got a shot in it? No, you don't. You're going to suppress that punk, though. That's probably what you're going to do. All right, Yeti. Step to the left one tile. Can you see that that freaking floater? Yep, that's the one. Thank you. All right, hang on there. The Muton's probably going to calm down now, unfortunately. Nope, still running away. Full panic from that Muton. I'm so glad. This would have been way worse if we hadn't done that awesome on that turn. If they're both going to fire, that means we can move. I mean, maybe. Fearless. Why don't you light up the background over there and see what that Muton's actually doing? Panicking. Straight up panicking. Oh, wow, Zimothy, you can't actually get there, huh? That's interesting. Try not to blow that mausoleum up. I mean, Yeti can move if I blow it up, to be fair. That's the outer range of that HE grenade. I do not have sapper on that engineer. It should be fine. It's a dead thin man. Okay, we're gonna get in there. If you can see the muton, that'd be nice. You can't see the muton. Okay, you're gonna probably suppress this turn. Yeah, you're gonna overwatch. Hibiko, you may as well take a shot, Hibiko. Sarah, how's your rocket doing right now? No more rockets. I mean, Sarah Face is the reason that we didn't die. She turned the tide. Why is your accuracy so bad? And this is so good. You don't have scope. High cover. Got it. Right, you got one more round of suppression. May as well make use of it. I need ammo. And then, Yeti, you can actually get crazy here. We need crazy right now. Fuck. Oh my god, another muton! Oh, that's the other panic muton. I forgot about that panic muton. <laughs> that's why. Not great odds over there. Yeti, I'm so so sad that I made you get crazy. We were actually doing well on this until I got cocky. I thought we were done with PAX and we had to push our advantage. I was wrong. Yeti's now in really bad trouble because I made that mistake because my adrenaline was so high. These floaters are not panicked. They're going to do smart things right now. We're worried about one of them suppressing Yeti and then the other one moving up. Airborne. Shit. Good panic resist. But that accuracy bonus through heavy cover is really not great. 
Mm, it was way worse before I killed a lot of people in one turn, but there were still a lot of them. Holy hell. Did none of them overwatch? Oh, fuck. Ooh. And that mutant is still terrified. It was not going to surprise anybody to learn I'm not going for Meld on this map. Surface, get over there so you can do some stuff. Renee, fall back and reload. Let's do this. Well, Yeti, you didn't die, so you got to come back here. Zimothy, go ahead and move up a little bit. You're going to smoke us for this crazy ass firefight that's about to happen. Okay, Yeti not dead. We stand. Can't quite reach with those, which means... You gotta be careful, smoke grenades, they lie. Not gonna get Sarah faced with this smoke grenade. Not if I also get myself, and I really need to get I really need to get Zimothy here. I guess that's more important over here. I want that to be everybody, but it's not going to be everybody, though. Let's try it. Okay, it's not... It's not Seraphase or... Or here we go. Great. Sure, take a pot shot. That's the only thing, man. Poison lockdown is a really big problem. Ooh, that wall better not collapse. Advance mutant. Okay. Blood call. Increase movement. Is that is that Mutown gonna rally? Shit. Okay. Probably should have fallen back when I had that chance. You're gonna have to act with acid on you. I think that's probably how this is gonna have to be. You can do anything right now. Are you going to panic if you grenade someone? You can't even grenade. Not my favorite turn ever. That's really all I can see here. Flip, maybe a kill. Nothing. Should have overwatched. Hindsight's 2020. If we're gonna miss 81% chance shots, it's only partially my fault when we all die here. This is this is probably a game reset. <laughs> it was a really good mission at the top. I'm not gonna lie. But oh wow. This map has always been a problem for me from that deployment, from even from early vanilla. I've, like, if I even in great campaigns, I will take injuries or losses on this specific map. I'm really fundamentally bad at this map. Did you just kill Renee through hardcover? And the panic chain's coming. 
You know who panicked? The person with the med kit that can stabilize her. Sarah's got a shredder rocket, which is a rocket. Probably have to use it on that muton. Yeah, I wish I could. I lost my assault to the, the mistake that I actually started tumbling the dominoes to our detriment here. For fuck's sake. How do you even see her from there? Yeah, I know you're sad. I know. Real, really, game? It's because of suppression. Can I unsuppress? Uh, maybe if Sarah face... Didn't I steady you? You probably lost steady because of what happened. Shoot it behind the muton, maybe? There's no way this is going to hit. But if it does hit, it'll break that suppression, and I need that right now. Okay, it missed, but it still hit some things. We'll take it. Okay. Beerless will we'll run some overwatches for us. I was going to say this would be the time that the 10% chance of hitting on uh, is going to actually take advantage. There it is. That's actually the second Overwatch is a much less hit. Do not panic, Beardless. <sighs> Shit. Totally not worth it. That sucks. Yeah, he's got to reload. Can't even take part in this, and that's it. Zimothy, can you please on one and three? Nope. And panic from the acid damage. You took one point to your armor. Yeah, this is a loss. This is, I'm going to play it out because, you know, <laughs> I'm going to play it out. But I, if it was just me, I'd reset right now. This is this is a collapse. Even if I pull out of this, we've already lost four team members that are really good. Wow, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad. It's bad. You sure are, friendo. Beardless, I knew you well. If you go has one hit point left, too, and I think only one medkit. Yeah, that's what we needed. Seraphis is out of cover because they finally crushed that wall. I feel like they don't have grenades yet, or they already would have used them. Vigo can't even get there to stabilize. <sighs> wow, 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 wow. Can you make evac? You can't make evac. Yeti could dash for evac, maybe. You're probably going to get killed. Go with God, Yeti. Opportunist! Wow. Yes, sir. That was a terrible mission. Cerevice is not getting out of here. Because she has the rocket launcher and she cannot make the run. Take one of them with you, Sarah. Semper fight. All that shit. Nice job! Six lost operators. That is, uh, I mean... God, that really hurts. It was also in the UK. We're going to have a panic spike here. That's where my HQ is. Let's see how bad this actually is. So many losses. That's that's that's. I mean, it is a lot. We can't lose that many, and continue long war. I don't have the money to replace them. We lost my scopes and alloy plates. Yeah, this is, it's over. Uh, we have UK is on the brink of leaving. That's where my HQ is. If they leave, I lose the game. Um, and we are down to thirty-two operators. 
which I mean, actually, I could send out. I could still keep actively doing missions while we're spiraling out. But without scopes, I can't hit things. Without armor, I can't survive close range contact. I do not have. I have one assault man, Connie Bot. It'll be ready for the next mission. My laser weapons almost got out. My laser weapons almost got out. Even with laser weapons, I would not have survived that mission. The mis the critical mistakes were moving OBS up, and losing OBS during that play could have been a a, a a grim but valuable sacrifice, right? If I had not also dashed Yeti up and activated the packs, I didn't realize we're still there. I had forgotten it was a moderate. Um, that was too much. As soon as Yeti activated those, it was that was that was it. That was it. Um, and if I, if I had not pushed OBS up that far, maybe even a square ba behind, OBS could have been in heavy cover and killed the other Muton still. That might have been okay. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, we get to restart. We get to restart Long War. Uh, <laughs> that's the end of this. That is the end of this particular campaign uh, as a loss, which is, uh, is how Long War goes sometimes. Uh, wow. Um I'm trying to think now of what else I could have done differently that would have made that better. Not just that tactical mission, but the... Um... Oh, right, it's okay. It happens. I've lost way more games than I've won. Um, I have... Yeah, I was 13 hours out from the first tech up coming in for my squad. That would have been half the squad would have had laser artil laser weapons, which would have been plus two to three damage for each, uh, each team member that had one of those weapons. Uh, which would have been very different. That would have been very different if I had laser weapons on that map and had not made those two mistakes. Um, and to get to laser weapons earlier, I could have researched things in a different order. Um, I well, I did push for laser, and I did build the early laboratory. Um, other things that sucked were the steam spawns on this map were pretty mean, and that one, that one uh, rush last time where. I, Every interceptor I had got fucking dominated and did no damage to that UFO that managed to shoot my satellite down after everything. And then we just got stomped because without the satellite in the air to see what was happening, they were succeeding in constant missions, which is why they got mutons and so many mutons so fast. They were able to tech up because I couldn't slow them down. Um, if I, you know, if I had the brain in my head now that I did, uh, like I mission four or five when that large. Uh, when that large supply barge landed, I could have maybe, hey. maybe gotten in there and uh, I got your F. I maybe could have gotten in there uh, and uh, taken that thing out. Uh, maybe. But I can try next time. Hugs for the lost game times. But the good news is that means we get to re-roll and folks that didn't get to see their names will get to see them. Oh, God. And uh, folks that died, their characters can get another shot, which would be really nice. So, so that's that. Thank you, everybody, for being here. For, I mean, I had fun, even though I lost. I'll, I'll, I'll get over it. Again, not the first time. Not the first time.